Tell me about this gorgeous little car. Well, it's handmade. It's completely handmade out of 16 coal rolled steel. I've got a body shop, but this car has never been in my body shop. The last three cars has been built in a two-car garage. sits beside the body shop. This is my son there, and I got uh, three uh, the three boys and a girl. Now, 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 you built this car all by yourself? It's all man? handmade. It's all handmade? Yeah, I built it all by myself. Oh my God, you're kidding. No, except the painting, he painted it. Now, how long did it take you to build this five, thing by hand? Five years. Now, now, did you buy the parts and assemble it? Or? No, no, I made all the parts. You it, literally it, fabricated it? It come from 10 sheets of coal rolled steel. Oh my God, coal man. 16 gauge steel. Now, hold on that. So, so now how did you bend all that pretty metal? Well, I got a forging table and I got a vise and a lot of hammers and dollies. Oh my God. And that's the way it's built. You did it in the old way, didn't the you? The old way. I don't have any fancy equipment. You ain't got no fancy equipment. So now, now come up my place and see it. So what kind of power plant did you go with? It's, uh, well, I got a 400 and one of them, that's got a 350 in it. You went 350? Chevy. So now, now what kind of car influenced you? <laughs> well, the best uh, thing that influenced me, when I was a kid, my mother died when I was five years old. 1929 when she's th uh, 29 when she was 29 years old I was five years old so I was sent out to to live uh, during the Great Depression when there was no right. help no money right right no no toys at Christmas and my toys I if I couldn't make them I didn't have any toys so I started making whatever out of wood little toy airplanes and wood that's right you just had to sled. make it yourself didn't you I made everything by myself so man, now, now how many cars have you made? I've made uh, seven. Seven cars. Still got four of them. Oh my goodness. That I can show you right now. Really? And I can show you all of them being built and the parts of how they look at it and build them. Well, you know, we might have to come out there and see that. Well, come right on out. All right. What, what's, your, what's your name, sir? Jim Bishop. Jim, buddy, I am truly impressed. I'm now, 80. I'm 89 years. I'm 89 years old. And I'll tell you what, I'm, 90, I'm 91 years old. I've seen a lot of cars, brother, and, and I, that's the first time I've been impressed in a while. Well, I'm 91 years old. and I'm still working. Well, man, I've been married for 68 years. The same woman. You're you're doing good. And you see, so you got that kind of stick to it of stew. That that's it, ain't it? right? Yeah. Life's beautiful. It depends on how you look at it. Hey, it's all good, ain't it? All good. Thank you, man, so much for being yeah. on the show. Okay. I've been, I'm looking for you to come out because... Oh, man. I hey, 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 we're switching cards after this. Okay. We're coming out. I'm looking for you. And all right, brother. I, I can I can prove this. Right. All of us, a lot of these guys are here right now. All that, right. That, that one right there, you can call him. He can tell you. The, the, no hair. <laughs> the, the other fella. The other boy. He'll tell you what it is. He'll tell you all about it, huh? And, and there's many, many more here can tell you the same thing. Well, sir. Well, what I'm telling you is the truth. Oh, I, hey, man, I'll tell you what. I, I'm amazed because I'll tell you what. I know I do a little body work myself, yeah. and when I see something like that, I know a feller's working hard. Yeah, yeah, it's hard work. All right, feller. We'll see you next time. And you keep cruising with the rider. I'll show you all the tools and what it made out of. All right, sir.